Warning! This channel is for adults only. I do not condone any illegal activities, and everything I record is for educational purposes only. With that said, I'm gonna teach you how to grow some weed. Dunking is basically bottom feeding a fabric pot. A major problem with fabric pots is that all of the soil on the outside of the pot dries up and eventually becomes hydrophobic. This creates natural rivers in the soil and despite heavy feedings, the water just drips out the side of the pot, making feeding useless. This also leads to salt building up in the soil and these concentrated pockets might make your plants look like they have excess or deficiencies when they really don't. Dunking fixes all of that. A dunk will balance the moisture level throughout all of the soil and completely eliminate all of these dry pockets. Since these buildups get washed out, this method doubles as a flush. This is my holy grail of watering plants in fabric pots, and honestly, I don't think there's a better way to feed soil plants. On top of that, if you suffer from fungus gnats, you could use this method to keep the top two inches of the soil dry, which will in turn prevent further infestations. Young plants can be overfed, so dunking is only recommended after a plant has an established root system. As soon as the plant's leaves extend further than the diameter of the pot, the plant is ready to dunk. I'm gonna teach you how to dunk a five gallon fabric pot and the tools you'll need is this brute bucket, a standard five gallon bucket, a towel, and optionally, a pH and PPM meter. Links to everything is in the description. The first thing you want to do is prepare your feed water. Rinse out all your buckets and add about three gallons of water into the brute bucket. Then add your nutrients to hit the levels you want and at the end, pH balance the levels. Optimized nutrient feeds are available on my site. You could record this input pH and PPM to compare to your output later on. Now set this feed bucket next to your five gallon bucket and place a towel in between. Now you're ready to dunk. You basically want to submerge the pot until the water is about an inch below the surface of the soil. This allows all of the soil below the top two inches to get fully saturated. Keep this pot submerged for eight to 12 seconds, then quickly lift the fabric pot up and over to the five gallon bucket. You want to place it on top at a 45 degree angle and let the water drain into the bucket. Fabric pots tend to trap water on the bottom, so by angle draining, you're preventing overwatering. You want to let the water drain until the stream turns into drips, and this can take anywhere from three to five minutes. Once you notice or hear the drips, Remove the pot carefully and you could place it back into your tent. You could continue to dunk other plants in the brute bucket as long as there's enough water to reach an inch below the surface. Do not mix the water that dripped out back into the brute bucket. This water that dripped out is called runoff and it'll tell you exactly what's going on in your soil at the root level. You now know what your plants are actually feeding at and you could modify your future feeds to get them closer to your targets. I like to weigh my pots after the feed and for five gallon fabric pots, my cue to feed again is when the weight of the pot falls below 15 pounds. I usually alternate dunks with top feeds. Now for three gallon fabric pots, a standard five gallon bucket works perfectly as the dunk container. To angle drain, I get a metal stand and I place it on a saucer and after the dunk, I lean my pot against the bucket. If you value this content, like, subscribe and hit that bell. And for the best tutorials on how to grow weed, check out hwgrow.com. Da, 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 da.
I'm gonna teach you how to grow some weed. How we grow, my 